did another Jay Cutler coming along help or hurt your brand? I think it, I think it helped. Yeah. You know, in 06 is when he got drafted. Yeah. He, he was playing at Vanderbilt and, uh, it was kind of funny cause I had jaycutler.com since 2000. So, uh, that's where I was doing a lot of my merchandising. So of course, when his name popped up and my real name's Jason, by the way. So I, I changed it when I got into bodybuilding and went to Jay. So if people from high school know me as Jason, uh, or my, my mom always calls me Jason, but, uh, <laughs> So he was drafted, so they're Googling Jay Cutler, and I was the biggest thing on the planet sure. in the sport of bodybuilding at that time. Quite literally. Yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> so it was funny because ESPN and Sports Illustrated, they would contact me a lot and compare. And, uh, you know, he, out of the gate it was great. He went to the Broncos, right? And then, uh, then of course, he went to the Bears, and not so well. Uh, he was performing, and, of course, you know, Twitter would go off and – I know on Sundays how he was performing based would, on my Twitter. They would tag the wrong account. They still to, the t- to this day. <laughs> if you said, okay, where do you see Jay Cutler the most? It's still at Mr. O.J. Cutler is my Twitter account. Mm-hmm. And I don't think he has a Twitter, so they just anyone would just tag it. Um, okay, I they think go he, to type in Jay Cutler, see a check mark, yes, and go, ah, that yeah, must be him. It's all blue check marked. And I mean, remember when I remember I used to sit on Twitter every night and before Instagram, you know, and I yeah, would yeah. talk on Twitter and just respond to fans and whatever. And then, uh, you know, he kind of, you know, started performing on Sundays or Monday Night Football. And, you know, we never had the chance to sit down and communicate. And you at some point, him? we're going, sometime we're going to. Uh, I know he's working on a podcast now, and we've had some discussions about sharing some time on the air. So I think it would be kind of cool. Because, you know, I always say I'm the real Jay Cutler. <laughs> Obviously, I'm older, too. So Yeah, you're the, you were the uh, first Jay Cutler. Yeah, so the first. And, uh, you know, it, it's just a lot of similarities with that. So That's so funny. I'd love to hear his take on things, too. Because I'm sure that messages for you get crossed for him, too. Yeah, when he was, you know, I remember in Chicago one time I was doing a, I did a whole GNC tour and, I toured the country for like six months on a tour bus and I did visits to all the military and GNCs. And I remember particularly because he, he played in, in Chicago, I had a huge lineup outside a GNC store. And I remember seeing guys coming with footballs and the jerseys because all they hear on the radio is like, Jay Cutler is going to be at this event this weekend. Yeah. They don't think, you know, they don't hear four time Mr. Olympia. They only hear Jay Cutler. They catch it. Oh, shoot. I want to go get a signed football or whatever. Yeah. And uh, did you sign some football? No, I, I, you know, they would, I see people either walk away or, you know, people would tell me in line, like this guy came and he thought it was Jay Cutler. And, you know, to this day, like there's still some confusion. Like a lot of people will call, you know, even when I call like my credit card company sometimes <laughs> and stuff and I'm dealing with like, is this like Jay Cutler, the bodybuilder or, you know, and then sometimes they ask it to the football player. So I think it's kind of funny, but I get a lot of people that actually, I feel really a lot better than I did the past years because I'm way more recognized now than ever through social media, but there's not a lot of mistakes now when people say, are you the bodybuilder when they hear my voice? Yeah. And maybe they've heard my videos enough or so I get a lot of recognition that way. What's the meanest Jay Cutler tweet that you received? Oh, it's just, they trashed. Uh, <laughs> Sundays were just brutal sometimes, you know? <laughs> that's, that's so mean. Hey, it's Chris, and thank you so much for checking out this video on my CVV Clips channel. If you haven't subscribed yet, I'd be so grateful if you could do that right now. Don't worry, the main channel is not going anywhere. We've got full in-depth interviews on the Chris Van Vliet channel. CVV Clips is for exactly that, clips from those longer interviews.